just to share your experience so initially we were like we were a quite tense like we never did all this uh, primary data thing or interviewing thing many of us are very shy to even speak to people and then speaking to people who, are, who do not even know our language was one of the biggest challenges at the very outset but as we went on in the journey from the month of march um, not only the people were so much cooperative but they spoke to us really well they also invited us we went on from we started our day with matri mandir then we went to our respective units be it bharat nivas to be to upasana all those uh, units we had a talk with the people and then we uh, sort of proceeded uh, we then came here to give our sort of uh, experience to ma'am <coughs> so all in all it was a very very good and enriching experience for all of us i believe others vision now our present secretary madam is uh, bringing actually we are planning to bring 50000 people uh, in our oval okay and also we are uh, working with the cpwd for various uh, crown road execution and other uh, infrastructure project okay in addition to that additional project like uh, mothers flow garden and other uh, very uh, beautiful uh, greenery and other things that is our main aim okay so in, in future definitely you will see lot of opportunity as well as that internship opportunity and also madam is doing with more than 500 bed uh, hostel arrangement and other things also we are signing mou with the id madras okay there are lot of uh, good activities are uh, initiated and it is under process so you please inform your uh, friends to visit our way okay thank you myself kuldeep i'm from pondicherry university when i got the opportunity to uh, do my internship in orwell i think that yeah it would be the same like uh, i mean other institute and uh, other organizations but uh, when first i came here our day was started with the gardening in orwell so the thing i got to know here that uh, there is a famous saying there is one famous saying in my rajasthani ki agar aap apne haath se jhadu nahi nikal sakte na to aapko apni dukan pe set banne ka koi hak nahi hai if you can't clean your shop then you have no right to be the owner of that shop it gives you the sense of dignity of labor where you got to know that yeah the people are doing these nominal works like um, safai gardening they are like um, same uh, all of us and after that um, we went to unit uh, we visited many units where we got to know that yeah this is how a society works like in politics there is a famous saying that uh, if economics is a gun then politics is uh, knowing when to pull, when to pull trigger so these two these two things work um, simultaneously so we got to know that how this orwell works um, 3 3000 people live here 700 units um, yeah many units uh, which are functionally very well um, like uh, e- eco society and um, every unit where people come and uh, sit to like in uh, today's world when uh, where people can't uh, live together in this world so 69 countries people are living happily together it was a very good experience for us and i got to, uh, uh, i got to know i got to learn very much so thank you it was a 21 day internship uh, like i'm doing my integrated pg integrated pg in uh, pondicherry university i was so close to orwell and i i, I didn't have a opportunity to get know what is orwell and what is orwell about and how they are working as a township by including many citizenship citizens from different parts of the world i couldn't get a inside view and how it's a uh, future of india like even if you search in google maps it shows us future of india orwell so i didn't i didn't have the opportunity to get know more about orwell in this 5 years and this 
internship of 21 days was a worthy opportunity that I could like capitalize to get know more about Oroville and it was pretty good experience to have to meet more people and to get familiar with them what is Oroville about and what are the objectives of Oroville and how is Oroville a changing capital for the future of India. I got to know about Matrimund and other units that are working inside Oroville which have transforming ideas about the future, sustainability and everything. Well, my name is Bahir. I'm a second year political science student. My experience uh, in Orville was so good. You know, that 21 days is a different experience for me. Uh, I am mingled, mingled with uh, so many people from many nationalities like America, United States, Israel. Yeah, that was so good. Then I was assigned to a special unit called 2B2. It was a great experience over there and uh, the echo, right, the ecosystem. It's a nice experience for me, that printing experience and the conversation with them. It's a very nice experience for me. Yeah, overall, it's a good life. I have experienced good things in Oroville. That's all, thank you. Myself, Sahad, uh, I am an integrated fifth year student at Pondicherry University. Uh, I think, first of all, uh, it's better to express the deep feelings in mother language. Uh, that's why uh, I am saying in Malayalam. I am saying in experience in 21 days of better experiencing uh, the culture and diversity of Oroville and the mother's vision. The assigned unit for us is uh, to be two. And the uh, experience, uh, we experience there a lot of things. Uh, like uh, leaf printing, uh, leaf print bolota, nalla urubadu urubadi worker abade seidu. Adakay engalay verum future lekala veru steppa iri kund karidu nandre. But kora soft we experience lot of so many soft skills from here. Uh, I think it's a better opportunity for us as an political science student. Uh, we understood a lot of things. Uh, related to our course political science uh, like uh, how a policy can formulate and that can implement in a uh, experimental town uh, township fine it's a, a good internship period and thank god for this thank you Oroville. thank you hello uh, i am tejeshwar and i am glad to be a part of Oroville internship i got a lot of experience through this internship which will i cherish throughout my life and if I want to tell one thing about Oroville is that uh, it is true to its name, which is the city of consciousness. People are con living a conscious way of life. Everybody is conscious even on little things. If you go to Sadhana forest, even though they have three ponds, they are conscious of uh, water usage. And uh, if you are going to buy a cloth, the least thing which we bother about is dye. If you go to 2B2, they are conscious that they are using natural dyes only and it's uh, it's too good to be true and as a student of political science and an international relations student nobody will believe me if i say like two thousands of people live from 60 different countries living together in a community life is way wonderful and their administrative structure like ptdc common kitchen solar kitchen and free store or waste management, everything is so wonderful. So, and I use this opportunity to thank everybody, like Jainti Ravi ma'am, uh, Maulika Ganguly ma'am, uh, Karthi Gardner, um, and my faculty coordinator, Kumaresan Raja sir. So, thank you.